black letter is pretty rare. From my time being on station at Yokota for the past four years, I have not seen a black letter aircraft. Uh, I believe it was June 11th of this year. It's a really big deal, it took a lot of coordination. In my 13 year career, this is only the second one I've witnessed. So, big coordination piece from both the scheduling and the execution side from the maintainers. A black letter is a black ink initial that goes on a 781H inspection form saying that the aircraft has no discrepancies on it whatsoever. This feat is rare in the maintenance world, but their dedication and motivation and teamwork enable it to happen. A discrepancy could be anything that is a detriment to how we receive the aircraft from the factory. So that could be chips and paint, scratches and glass, or it could be anything operational related, engines not putting enough power output or props not spinning correctly. I'm the floor lead here in the ISO section, so I have a team of maintainers, and all I do is just help guide them and figure out the plan of attack what the squadron and the group do is that they communicate with each other. They help us get the specialties and specialists and other career fields to the aircraft and do maintenance in the safest, most strategic order so that we can get the plane out on time. All flights within the MXS contribute. So that could be flights, age flight, that, uh, who bring us our power carts, who bring us our scans that we do maintenance on. That could be P-Mail, who calibrates the torque wrenches and tools that we use, accessories flight, who actually services the equipment that we use to service the aircraft. Being a dedicated crew chief means that you're responsible for all the maintenance that happens on the aircraft, ranging from inspections, servicing, ordering parts, looking over forms, as well as helping out other shops with their maintenance on the, their airplane. Seeing my aircraft take off with a black litter was a great feeling, almost indescribable, instilled a great sense of pride in myself, especially with it coming back with no discrepancies. It was, it was awesome, it was a great feat, and I couldn't have done it without the support of everyone here. The coordination is key, it's vital. No matter how many maintainers you have that are gathered, ready to work, ready to put tools on the aircraft, if we don't have coordination and strategy, then we're all going to trip over each other. For the MXG, it means that it's not a reflection of what we did specifically for that plane. It's a reflection of everything that we've been putting together months, quarters, years prior, leadership, everything that we've worked towards to create an establishment that we can produce a black letter. That's the significance. Whether it's from the maintenance operations flight that provide the special programs to the maintenance squadron and to the aircraft maintenance squadron, we are united in excellence in everything that we do and that is how we came to do this. And that's how we do our mission. We deliver mission ready aircraft, equipment and airmen across the Asia Indo-Pacific region producing tactical airlift with strategic impact.